you go on the, the, the press conferences and there's the poor minister and the two experts there, which I think is a good idea, as opposed to, uh, well, Scotland, they do it differently. Scotland don't have an expert there. They have a person doing the sign language. The Welsh have that as well. I mean, what's that about? Uh, what? OK, we know there are deaf people. My best friend was uh, deaf when I grew up. His name was Tommy Smith. He came from Woolwich. And I took him to see a musical. Yeah, I took a deaf mate to see a musical called Paint Your Wagon. And he wasn't really too sure about sound. To explain sound to a deaf person is difficult and takes an expert to be able to do that. But So he didn't understand quiet and loud. And in the middle of the film with Lee Marvin and everyone was crying while he was singing Wandering Star, he was leaving home and his friends. Tommy whispered in my ear, This film fucking shit! We never went back. Anyway, Tommy, I'm glad you watch it. But all these... Uh, we don't have it on, on the on the British uh, English Parliament, fraudulent slip, English Parliament, because it is no, it's the British Parliament. It is, isn't it? It's from it's from Downing Street. Why don't we have a person that does the signing? I don't know the answer to that. I tried to learn signing, but I couldn't pull the faces. I know this sounds awful, and I'll get slagged off. But it's not just the fingers. I remember I was watching this in fascination one morning during the floods that we had, that other fucking thing. Um, and there was uh, there was floods in a town called Cockermouth, wasn't there? Poor bastards, they got hit, Cockermouth. And I thought, how's this fucking woman going to do this in sign language? Well, I'm main, I'm main, I'm down, I'm main, I'm main, and up my north, I'm playing. Anyway, so there you go. But why do we have these press conferences? Why do they bother? So... Prime Minister, if you're back Monday, don't take questions from these moron people. Why do they do it? It's their agenda. They just want the blame. So, Secretary of State uh, for the uh, Health Minister, Matt Hancock. Um, Minister, um, you did say you have 100,000 tests by the end of the month. Uh, it's now five days to go. Are you going to own up that you are a complete tosser and it's not going to happen? Or, or are you going to carry on to try and solve this problem that we're having? What, what do they want? They want the minister to come up and say, you're right. Everyone go on GMTV. OK, peers, you're right. I'm wrong. I am a fucking arsehole beyond belief. I will resign. OK, and then you can get on with it. See how you do that. You go in every day. You don't have to do Fridays because you don't do Fridays. But peers, for Christ's sake, stop putting them on the spot. Try and let's move. Oh, it fucking drives me mad.